GSC Movies, or we call it as Golden Screen Cinemas, was founded on April 1, 1987, which was 36 years ago. It is the largest cinema exhibitor in Malaysia, which exhibits and distributes films and content in Malaysia. At first, GSC used a paper ticket system for their operation. The customers need to go to the counter to buy the tickets and they need to queue up every time they want to buy the ticket. It is called the counter cinema booking system. This system makes it hard for customers to know the show time of a particular movie or upcoming movies. They need to visit the cinema just to know the show time and availability of the movie. Then. In the year of 2000, GSC introduced the online e-ticketing system which is a web-based system that is automatically updated based on database data. So, they created their official website which is www.gsc.com.my and in 2007, GSC and my bank had collaborated to offer a ticketing system that allows customers to purchase tickets online and also allows my bank to you users to transact directly from their debit card without using a debit card. On October 13, 2011, GSC released an application for the customers to book their tickets online, which is GSC mobile app. The customers can sign up to be a member and collect points. This app helps the customer to know the showtime of the movies. This app also provides F&B options. The customer can add on any kind of food that is available such as popcorn, nuggets and drinks. GSC also offers a self-service kiosk for the customers. The kiosk reduces ticket queues by allowing users to book and pay for their tickets online and then print them when they arrive at the theater. By using touch screen base, they can order movie tickets and favorite snacks, as well as paying with cash or a credit or debit card that process and print ticket instantly. Customer can also redeem their reward points by scanning their members QR code at the kiosk. There is seven key system elements that will be discussed, which is environment, boundary, interface, input, component, output, and storage. Environment. Everything that outside the system is called as environment. It is defined as an assumptions, constraints, and inputs to the system. The environment of GSC mobile app that can be seen when you want to sign up is mobile number, email address, and location. The users need to connect with internet or Wi-Fi to use this mobile app. The email address needs to be registered with Gmail or other email applications. Same goes to the GSC website. The details that you need to fill is same. The definition of boundary is the separation between elements that are inside and outside the system under consideration such as components and storage. For example, JSC mobile application have a boundary when the ticket reach limitation. This might be a limitation on the number of tickets that can be processed or reserved within a certain time frame. If there is a limitation on the number of advanced tickets that can be sold, it means that the advanced booking quota has been reached. Thus, users need to wait for another slot or the other day. Interface is the place where two components or the system and its environment meet or interact. There are five types of interface which are graphical user interface, common line interface, menu driven interface, form based interface and natural language interface. These are the examples of the interface in the GSC mobile application. The first one is the interface of home screen and the second one is the interface of movie details. Input is a data element that the user enter into the system for usage. Based on GSC mobile application, several input need to enter for the first time user such as name, mobile number, email, password, date of birth, gender, profession, location and certification of 18 and above. To enter the application, the user is required to log in using mobile number and password that has been set up during sign up session. Then, the user can choose between two types of services, now showing and advanced sale. Now showing is a movie available during one or two days prior to the screening date, while advanced sale is blockbuster movie that are available for sale for 7 or 14 days in advance. After choosing the services, the next input is required is date, location, time, type of hall and also the seat that is still available.
After selecting the seat, the type of ticket is required to enter. There are six types of tickets which are adult, children, OKU, senior citizen, student and twin. After that, user have the choice to input food and drink that they want at e-combo. Finally, it is time to proceed with the payment. The input determine the price of the ticket. There are multiple payment options to choose from such as debit or credit card, MX and Visa checkout. There is also online banking available for payment such as Maybank to you, RSB Now and Hong Leong Connect. Component is the activities or processes within the system that produce system outputs or convert inputs into intermediate forms. Components also known as subsystems or modules. The process to calculate the total price of movie ticket is one of the components in the GSC mobile application. The total price of movie ticket is different based on types of halls, types of seats and the food and drinks that the user have ordered in the GSC mobile application. Output is a process information in usable format and comes in many different forms. From the GSC mobile application, the output of this application is the ticket and also the receipt. The output that come out is in the QR code that user will receive after the payment is successful. The QR code can be scanned right away at cinema checkpoint. Alternatively, we can print it as a self-print ticket and bring it to cinema where the GSC staff at cinema checkpoint will scan the QR code on the ticket. The output on the ticket shows the title of movie, confirmation ID, QR code, date, time, location and seat number. The ticket purchase confirmation will be sent to user's email. User can print self-print ticket that sent in the email inbox. Storage means the process of keeping data and information in a particular space until it is needed. It is a mechanism that enables a computer to retain data either temporarily or permanently. To illustrate, uh, this application allows users to view booking history for tickets that are scheduled for the future or have already expired. Customer will able to obtain the information they want because of this feature. Uh, the date, time, place and see are displayed on the application. A confirmation ID and a quick response code are also provided. Uh, to conclude, uh, GSC Mobile made it simple for users to make purchase online at any time or anywhere. Most people would rather purchase tickets online rather than deal with the hassle of visiting the movie theater counter because it offers an online ticket service. The 7 key system element in this application is easy to use and has an evidence structure for users to follow. That's all from us. Thank you for watching.